there. This is uh, very, very skilled sword is. Um, it's a it's part of our hobby now that uh, just not as popular as it used to be many, many years ago with the uh, control line, but um, it's still a very, very skillful, very skillful discipline of our hobby. And these guys here are uh, basically some of the best in Ireland and some of our UK champions as well. So they're very, very experienced guys playing here today. So we're just about to get things ready, and it's a nice little scale, and it's like swordfish. So he's just about to work, and then we pop up in the grass a wee bit. Now she's starting to roll. But yeah, that needs a way. Oh, that's a nice one. So there's her right away now. And she just sounds like the real thing about the motors are stopping down up the line. And, yep, he's got our goal there, so he's playing well. Peter seems to have all the aerobatics. And if you ever fancy chatting some of this here, pop down to the uh, Belfast Club, come chat with some of the guys. They're usually there on a uh, Sunday afternoon. And uh, have a chat with them. Maybe even have a look yourself. Great coffee. As I say, I've been playing from six, seven years of age, and I got involved in it. And, uh, after a while, it becomes an obsession, so it does. But there's not many different types of hobbies. I'm just getting some smart guys saying that's the only thing you need 50 and all that. <laughs> but um, as I say, there we're just, uh, it's a great hobby, a great thing. We're many aircraft, we're many different types of aircraft to fly. And as I say, there's something for everybody, so there's basically here. So you can hear Eric's a deep and sounds like the old bike in as he flies right and right and right. Uh, just flies Peter, he's doing a aerobatic schedule. Flying, flying and flying. So it is just keeping her going there. And as I say there, Peter's very experienced. So they